Music is a tremendous gift from God. Music is just an overflow of a heart that's filled with, with love, and it has to come out somehow. It's part of our life that we sing to the Lord. So I look at this CD of sacred music as like an overflow of our prayer, something that we'd be doing anyway. It's really interesting being a part of such an elaborate recording of our music because normally it's just us and the Lord, you know, and we sing for God. We still are singing for the Lord. God gives us our voices as a gift, as a gift to us, but He gives it to us so that we can give it back to Him. The Dominicans have a very active life of the mind. Dominic founded an order with the whole purpose of preaching truth because to know something is to love it more and more. Again, if we know more of God, then we love Him more. We really are formed in the chapel with our union with Christ and daily mass and all the prayers and, and the quiet time of, own, of one's own prayer. Then it's like a fountain that just fills up and then we go running out on the world to give to everyone, you know, because you just can't contain that much joy, that much goodness. The fact that our community is so young and has grown from four to over 115 at this, at this point, and with an average age of 28 years old, you sense a vibrancy and a real holy energy. We are actually growing so rapidly that we are now expanding into our first priory because we have so many people living here. So we're going down to Austin, Texas to build for another 120 of our sisters. This recording is helping us to learn how to sing as one voice. The spiritual content of the music has a great deal to do with its appeal. The musical textures are rich and beautiful because I, I think we respond extremely positively to the human voice. As Dominicans, we express our love of Mary and the Eucharist very much through the liturgy. And so these hymns that we chose, they really are hymns that are very much kind of us, like they're, they're the way that we would express in a very tender and a very intimate way our love of God and of the Blessed Mother. The Te Deum is a song of praise and thanksgiving for the church. I know we sing it, you know, before big solemnities and big feasts of the church. This specific rendition was written by a priest friend of the community, Father Michael Keating. It's a rendition that the sisters have written and I've arranged a little bit to be able to play along with it. It's just such a wonderful gift to be able to give this to this song. It's so exciting to be a religious in our modern world because we really are in so many ways countercultural, and that seems to get everyone's attention. One of the very special times was when Oprah approached us wanting to know if our sisters would be willing to come on their program. In fact, twice. She had us on twice. And then another thing, the Game Channel asked us if we would be on their American Bible Challenge. It ended up being such a beautiful, beautiful witness to the church. You enter the convent and you, you think you're going away to a hidden life with the Lord, and you are. You know, so why would we open our doors to say Oprah or the Today Show? To let the microphones in, to let the cameras in, the recording people in. It's for the good of the church, really, that we would, that we would ever even think about doing something like this. We're not movie stars. We live our quiet life in the chapel and in our teaching primarily. But the world paid attention because they want what God in His goodness has given to us. And I think that's why they were interested. When we came to this community, we came because we wanted to follow the Lord, yes. But everyone's called to do that. We're called to do this together. 
So it's really beautiful to be able to then give this music to the world.